We're often taught from a young age how important self-care is. We're taught by our mothers, our aunts, our grandmothers, from watching them put on lipstick to watching them in a salon get their hair done, painting their nails, having a manicure, a pedicure, or even just putting uh, a bubble bath in their bath water. So we're taught at a young age how important self-care is, but the problem is we oftentimes forget it or we're just too busy. So today I'm going to share with you four simple things that have been working for me to include a little bit of extra TLC in your life. So pay attention. I want you to go on and drop me a comment and let me know the ways that you remember growing up watching your mother or your grandmother or your aunt take care of themselves and how that has impacted you. So leave a comment below this video. Hey there, busy professional woman, career woman extraordinaire. I'm so proud of you. If you are rocking what you're doing. My name is Milan Perry of So Natural Wellness and of the Chic Women Don't Diet Lifestyle. Women need enough sleep in order to look and feel their best. So when it comes to eating, you have to make sure definitely that you're eating the right thing. So making sure you're putting the right foods into your body but on an external level sleep impacts how we look because it's not just what we do when we're when we are awake but how much our body rests at night because if you have a lot of things on your mind you're stressed you're always worried about things things that are sometimes not even within your control and you're losing sleep over it anything outside of what you can control don't lose rest over, don't lose sleep over, because when, what generally happens is, when you decide to wear makeup, it's not going to look right on you. The application will just be off. You, want, you will be trying to figure out, why does, my make, why does my makeup look different today? Why is it changing? And it may not even be about the makeup. It's just, um, you're not getting enough sleep. Your body needs to um, feel the effects from the inside, de-stressing, and then, and everything else will look good for you. So I want you to put your thoughts to paper right now. And I want you to tell yourself all the things you love about yourself. So maybe you can start your letter off something like this. After you've set up your space and pulled out the fragrances that you want in the room. So you can start with something like this. Hmm. Hey girl. It's been a while since we've had a chance to talk, so I thought I'd write you a letter telling you all the things I love about you. You're an amazing woman, and I'm so proud of everything you've accomplished. You never give up, no matter how hard things get, and that's something truly special. You're also compassionate and loving, always putting others before yourself. I don't know what I would do without you in my life. So here's to you, my wonderful sister friend. Have a great day to myself. Number three is taking yourself on a date. Don't hesitate to do something for yourself. Go out to eat by yourself. Go see a movie or just walk around the city. No, and it, no, it's not lame. Between work and family life, I know it may seem like there's not enough time in a day to take care of yourself. So sometimes you may have to get creative. Here's my last tip for you today. Number four is to eat healthy, chic food. So basically what that is, is eating food that is going to allow you to maintain your energy levels, food that would allow you to look good from the inside out. And I wanna make sure that you're filling your body with plenty of plant-based foods, which I often find is lacking in many of my clients that I work with. And um, these foods, these particular foods, they are foods that are loaded with minerals, uh, phytonutrients, phytonutrients that are really excellent for women who are going through menopause and especially foods that would help to boost your libido and so many other symptoms that are hormonal when you're going through menopause. If you're one of those women, you grew up in a household where you didn't have to cook or maybe you went off to college. So once you got older, you're, you know, after college, you just didn't really, you know how to cook, but you didn't really know how to cook in a very healthy way, in a very sustainable way. So you still even now feel that you lack certain skills in that area. Cooking is the ultimate expression of self-love. And if you don't enjoy it, that's because you've never experienced 
the art of cooking at home. You've never learned how to cook well. Most women that I talk to who don't like to cook, it's because they haven't found the beauty in it. And no one's taught them that. There are a lot of things that our mothers, our grandmothers, our aunts taught us in how to be beautiful, how to wear makeup, how to wear lipstick, how to take care of ourselves, wearing the right perfume. But they, a lot of them didn't actually teach us how to cook. Some did. I won't say not every woman. Some parents pass that on. But there are a lot of women who didn't have that opportunity. They didn't have someone to show them how to do it. If they're not working with me as one of my private chef clients, more than likely they're working with me in my cooking course. So this is the Chic Cooking Academy. So I'm going to take your excuses away today. So if you haven't been taking care of yourself in this area of dining and dining well at home, I'm going to take away that excuse because in my Chic Cooking Academy, I'm going to help you to commit to so in my Sheet Cooking Academy, right here on my website, So Natural Wellness, I want to show you how to how to enjoy your bold wine, indulge in decadent dessert, and wear the clothes that you want to wear while losing weight. So check this out. Once you go into the culinary section, I want you to start to develop a love affair and a relationship with food. And this is something that um, I find a lot of women are lacking in. So I want you to eliminate the feeling of being stuck with a way of cooking at home so that you can feel more confident and more at ease in you, in, with meal prep time. So one of the things that I like to go through and work with, uh, with my students who are going through the Chic Cooking Academy, this is not your typical um, cooking school where you go and they give you some direction, but then no, this is a gourmet food and wine cooking course. This is we are ladies, if you love wine and you love food, then you will love this course because we are integrating wellness into your lifestyle. And this is not just about the food, okay? Because you can't have, if you want to be well, you want to be healthy, you must include the food element. You must include uh, things that are going to uh, make you feel good, give you more productivity, including more plant-based uh, foods into your lifestyle and this is a really unique approach for women who also admire the French way of life that French way of je ne sais quoi so I just want to take you down through my page for a quick second and you're going to learn how to be a lot more structured in your kitchen if you aren't and you're also going to learn a lot of tips and how to lose weight and keep it off we're going to do some um, learn how to properly shop in a grocery store in the market so you feel more at ease with that um, we're going to i'm going to introduce you to a lot of amazing new flavors and we're going to talk about the difference in good fats and bad fats but all the while you're going to be balancing your hormones you're going to be enjoying delicious food that will help you to, to uncover what is your unique biochemical individuality? What are the foods that will help you to thrive? What are the, will help you to thrive and to make you feel good in your skin? We are going to include lots of um, plant-based foods. Animal-based foods are, I love animal-based foods, so this is not a vegan course. This is a course that does have animal protein in it. So if you are someone who's gluten intolerant, this is perfect for you. If you're someone who's very picky, this is not the course for you. And this is an eight week course. Um, I'm going to show you how to speak the language of wine. So you must be one of those women who enjoy a good glass of wine, because I'm going to show you if you don't know how to speak the language. I'm going to show you how to understand wine, how to make sure that you're always pairing it with the right foods, how you're eating the right um, foods along with it, along with your wine, how to cook seasonally. We are going to um, see, talk about presentation, presenting, because I feel that you eat with your eyes before you start to eat with your mouth. And you also eat with your nose. So you're going to be looking at food. You're going to know how to cook food that is appealing to you and to everyone else that you serve. But it's always important to serve yourself first because you can't pour from an empty cup.
So I think this would be beautiful course for you, especially if you want to live a healthy lifestyle. And remember, it's never too late. Even if cooking is not your forte, you will definitely get healthier. If so by the end of this course, you're going to be able to do so much. You're going to be able to cook chic food without the use of a cookbook. You're going to be able to create a gourmet chef inspired menu, show it off on your Instagram. You will normalize your hormone symptoms. If you're having any, if you're in menopause, you're going to perimenopause and you want to find out the best foods to eat. You will have a clear structure of an eating plan weekly. You will learn how to properly menu plan and just forget about all that dieting. This is a bougie way to eat. This is a very chic way to eat. You're gonna be on the journey of maintaining your weight and also learning how to properly use and purchase a chef knife. If you're using a block of knives in your home, don't do that. Please don't do that. You need a real knife. And this will give you a very solid plan for dining that reflects your cultured life. So my, um, some of the people that went through my course, if you have any questions about it, all of your questions will be answered before jumping into my course, more success stories. And this is a community of women, um, the chic women don't diet. So I'm all about supporting other women and helping other women to thrive. So I'm going to take away all of your excuses for not really taking care of yourself the best that you can. And I want you to go on and sign up for this course. It's going to be starting soon. And, um, and I look forward to having you in it. Once we're in it, we will be in it for the next eight weeks, having so much fun. So I want to include the link below this video and I can't wait to see you in this course. We're going to have so much fun and I can't wait to meet you. And until our next time together, stay beautiful and healthy.